welcome to another game in which I'm going to be playing Nasus Jungle versus a Shaco Jungle. I have Ezreal Leona in bot lane versus a Tristana Soraka. I have a Jace top lane versus an Aurelia. I've got an Ari mid versus a Diana. So, why did I pick Nasus? Uh, I felt like a bit of Nasus, it's solo queue, and I just thought, you know what, I'm going to end up playing jungle this game probably, so... I'll just pick Nasus and Jungle. Um, so naturally, I'm going to start with Machete, 5 pots. Uh, I'm running Smite, obviously, for the Jungle. And then I have Ghost. Uh, the reason I take Ghost is because, currently, Junglers uh, are struggling to catch people. And a lot of Junglers are playing... A lot of Junglers benefit heavily from Ghost. So things like Volley Bear, things like Nasus, they all benefit quite heavily from Ghost. So, anyway, I get a nice leash on the blue, I get that over and done with, and I then go off to farm. Naturally, uh, I started with E in the jungle, one for AoE damage, clear speed, and because it, theoretically, it does more damage. And then, just gonna farm up, play it safe, because it's Shaka, I don't know what he's doing. I don't want to risk going into my j even my own jungle and just get caught out. So, my main aim, farm. I know that Shaco's top at this point though, so I'm like, okay, I, I reckon I'm strong enough. I don't have my wither yet though, but I still feel that I can do something if need be. I don't know. And then I go, right, okay, I know that Shaco's ganking mid lane. There's no way he's not far that he's farming his jungle. So I come into mid lane. Ari's nearly dead. Shaco's under the tower, I'm like, oh hello. Hit him. He's dead. And then Diana dives a bit too far and boom. I get a reset on my double buff, and I've got a kill, Ari gets a kill. They get a kill on Ari onto the Diana though, but in the end, the benefit is all on our side. I've got double buff for even longer, I get far mid lane, I'm nearly already level 6 at this point. That's just how, how strong I suddenly became, just because of that. Um, so I decide, you know what, I'm going to go gang bottom. So, I wander down, my team jumps in a little bit, nearly catches them, and then I wither, and then I, I hit Soraka, and then Spirit Fire and walk off, and then I'm like, okay. So, I didn't know, I don't know if they have a ward, but I just sit in this bush, I, yeah, they, they sort of keep their distance, and then Leona goes in, I come round, and by the time I go around the corner, the Tristana's already dead, and I'm like, okay, fine. Come on, Ezreal. Let's just push this tower down a little bit. Might as well. Take take the lead. I've got nothing else better to be doing. And then I go off and I farm my golems and continue to stack up my Q. At this point, I have plus 30 damage. It's not too bad. Most of that due to being in mid lane, really. And then my double buff wears off and I'm like, okay, I need to look for another gank. I've got level 6. And I decide, you know what? I'm going to wander around here. I know Shaco's nearby because I just saw him. And I'm like, okay, come here, Diana. I already know the Ari's low, so bait, perfect bait. And I'm just like, come, come back. Nope. Okay, I'm, I don't want to risk it. And then she, she does this, and I'm like, okay, fine. Chase, chase, chase. Um, I pop my ghost, and then boom, hit down Shaka a little bit. And then I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna sit here and farm for a bit. I, I couldn't care less about the fact that I'm pushing the lane for my Ari, because, to be honest, I'm using it more as bait any anyway, and I might as well just sit here and um, gain even more power. And then, I'm like, uh, I see my red buff, so I'm going to go clean that up a bit, and then I'll go back. Failing a little bit on the stacking of my Q at this point, but overall feeling pretty strong and pretty beefy at this point. So, go off to blue, get this for the Ari, even though she's just bait. I know she's going to die anyway. I'm like, hello, Shaka. Okay, I don't really want to face you 1v1, because you're kind of a pain in the ass. No point, you'll just kite me around the fucking map forever. So, I'm like, okay, I'll just go farm a bit more then. Farm up wolves, farm up wraiths, Quick, quickly, boom. And then, I'm like, okay, I'm, I'm going to come into mid lane again. I, I like using this Ari's bait at this point. Same level as her. Um, I know that Shaco's coming. I'm like, okay, look, Shaco's coming, dude. Play it safe. Don't don't get caught out. And then naturally, my Ari does the normal thing, gets bait, 
muted, and then she goes in a little bit too deep, takes a bit of damage, Shaka comes in, pokes at me, I'm like, whatever. So, I'm just going to sit around here and wait patiently. I know they're going to dive her, she's low, so I'm going to continue to use her as bait, pretty much. I sense that Shaka is going to dive, but no, instead it's just Diana, and I, I, I slow her, I hit her, I hit her again, and I ult, and then I'm like, you know what, I don't give a damn, ghost, hit, dead. Probably didn't need the ghost, I probably would have caught her or hit her with my E and killed her that way, but I just wanted to get over and done with. Um, just because of being this fed though, I, I did build um, Spirit of the Odd Lizard, which means that my AoE damage is a lot higher, I clear waves ridiculously quickly because of it, and it's even scarier to be near me because my ult's going to be doing even more damage, my E's doing more damage, and then Shaco comes in, tries to sort of go on me, and they were like, you know what, we don't care, you're going to die. I'm like, just leave you with a wither, Diana, grow old, stupid witch. Anyway, and then I go off and I farm some more. I steal some Shaco jungle oil because it tastes nice and I might as well. So, I then head top lane and I'm like, let's dive this. I ping a little bit too early, Jace just jumps in, kills her, I'm like, oh. Okay, I kind of wanted to help you with that and get an assist, you know, maybe even get the kill, but okay. And then Diana, it, the um, Jace goes back and I'm like, you know what? I can push this tower. I might as well. Shaco comes along, and then I, I kite him a little bit. I don't know which one's the real one. I wither the clone, and I'm like, oh, okay, fine. And then, for some reason, he, he comes sort of back onto me, and I'm like, why would you do this? And I just walk up, spirit fire, kill him. And I'm like, mm, okay, farm. Yoink. Yoink. More farm. Yoink. Might as well. At this point, I have plus... 69, so yeah, stacking isn't going so well for me, but I've now got an Aegis of the Legion. So, feeling pretty strong, pretty beefy, pretty scary. I get blue buff for the RE, or, well, I would have done, but my um, Elder Lizard stole it from her. Fine, whatever, she's bait anyway. So, I come down bot lane in the hope of maybe catching somebody, killing them, and then I'm like, ooh, stack, yoink. I, uh, the, the Leona really wasn't pleased with me for that, but I didn't care. I was like, hmm, Shaco. If Shaco goes on to the Leona, I clet, I wither, grow old, you stupid clown, and then I just punch him to death, pretty much. And then farm up, push the lane, start searching for a tower, I might as well, you know. Tower's pretty low, so I just start hitting it. Hitting it. Hitting it. My tower. Farm up. And then I'm like, ooh, dragon, 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 dragon. Let's go. Go, go, go. I, I fancy just getting the dragon quickly. Kill that. And then we go for Tristana. And then my team jumps on her. I wither. Grow old. Stupid little yordle. Pink thing. Die. I, I, I actually decide to be nice and give the kill over to Ezreal at this point. And then Ari starts baiting a little bit. Uh, dies to the Shaco. I can't really chase after him. He's just going to kite me around anyway. So, I, I protect my red buff, and I take it, I'm like, yeah, okay, I'm fine with that. And then, find that he's uh, been an irritating little Shaco and stolen my big raid. Fine, I'm just going to go farm in lane anyway. Couldn't care about my Ari. Yoink, farm. Hello, Diana. You're going to grow old again soon. Um, and then, catch out the stupid Soraka. I wanted to give the kill to the Ezreal, but, you know... My uh, damage was just too high, and then I dive the Diana, kill her, take the tower, push up, yoink. Pretty beefy at this point, I'm 8-0-3, I, I, I couldn't give a damn about anything right now. I just walk up to people and kill them, because I can, I might as well, got nothing else to do. So, we, I go back, I'm like, yeah, I might as well. So, I get a Bulwark, I get a Sheen, I get Zerka Greaves. I, it's not like I need Mercs at this point. I, I just walk up to people and they die anyway. <laughs> I feel pretty too, I, I, I just feel like I'm on top of the world at, the point, at this point. And I just walk up to people and they die. I might as well. So, continue to farm, push, see if I can make somebody grow old and kill them. Um, push up the lane, farm a little bit while I'm here. Might as well make the shack grow old because I can. 
stupid clown. Anyway, and then it sort of turns into a stalemate while we wait for Ari. <coughs> and then we push up, we look for an opportunity. Maybe they haven't got wards some places. And then the Tristana pokes me a bit. I'm like, I'm a bit irritated at that. It's kind of rude of her, to be honest. Um, and then we push in. Or at least try to. Ari's still not here. She was pushing top. Fine, whatever. Make one of them grow old. Kill. Chase down this um, pesky Aurelia that's trying to kill my Ezreal. Just die, fool. And then... Chase down the shack a little bit. Uh, he, he, he deceives away. I'm like, okay. I'm just going to die this Soraka. Come here. Come here, Shrek. Yeah. I'm like, oh, okay, fine. I can't be asked to die the tower. It's not worth it. And then I know she's just going to jump over the wall, so I leave her alone. And then we see a Shaco here, and I don't get anything out of it. It sucks, but oh well. Still feeling on top of the world, like I, I control the map. Like I control how this game's being dictated and the way it's being played. So, push in a little bit. I get caught a little bit, and I take a bit of damage. I'm a bit scared now, because they're actually starting to hurt me. And then we go in, and... I wither the Diana because I hate her and she's just a free kill at this point. And then Aurelia's trying to kill me. I'm like, nope, not happening. Bye. See you, see you Tristana. Don't, you're not killing me. Farm up a Wraith and go back to base. Start building up from my yeah, Iceborne Gauntlet. And I go top lane because there's farm. I might as well. Yoink. More farm for this um, Nasus. Yoink. Pushy, pushy, push, push, pushy, pushy, push, push, pushy, pushy, push, push. Um, take up all the farm, push down this tower, scare off the Aurelia because she doesn't really want to face me. Nearly kill her, and then so I walk off and I'm like, mm, ah, shit, maybe I can catch someone out. Nope. My team's sort of chasing them and sort of not chasing them, and I'm like, nah, actually, that's a bad place. Doesn't matter how beefy I am, I don't really want to walk into three of them on my own. So, pretty strong at this point, my, te my Jace and Ari go up and kill people, and I'm like, oh, okay, fine, red buff time, donk, 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 Ezreal kind of understands that, to be honest, I might as well take it and just sort of continue to punish and kill people, and then I'm like, okay, I'm here, and I want to take the tower, bolt, boom, chase down, Aurelia, lead my team to kill the tower, hit her, hit her, Hit her, hit her, and boom, dead. Oh, look, I see it. Tristana, grow old. I'm like, okay, fine. You don't want to grow old and die to me. Fine, I'll just start taking this tower and we'll take it. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Take the tower, go for the inhibitor. At this point, thoroughly in control of the game. No, not a lot they can do against the 908 uh, NASA running around with a uh, Iceborne Gauntlet, Elder Lizard, and Bulwark. Yeah, pretty beefy, pretty strong. Not a lot they can do. So I go back, I buy a giant spell, because I might as well rub it in a bit more, be even more tanky, even more irritating. And then my team has a little argument without me. They kind of regret it a little bit in the end. And then we yeah, like, okay, fine, whatever. We don't need Ari. Ari's crap anyway. She's useless. So we'll just take over the Baron. And then they come in, try and stop us. I'm like, you know what? That ain't happening. Come back here. Kill the Aurelia. Chase down the uh, stupid Diana. Kill her. And then chase down the rest of them. Chase them down. Oh, look. Beat. Bonk. Bonk. Kill. And then we just sort of push him for the win at this point. It's not a lot they can do. They've lost two inhibitors. We forced them to fight a barrow and they lost naturally because, you know, I'm now ridiculously powerful. And we just push him for the win at this point. There's nothing they can do. Um, and pretty much it all scaled from that one um, Shaku gank, which turned into me getting a kill. And it kind of just, it just snowballed me. And I just continued to snowball because they continue to make mistakes. And this is what happens when you feed a jungler. Especially a jungler like Nasus. But anyway, GG well played. Thank you for watching.